this kind of meditation, but it is, a, it is an experience, it is a different experience. It is not being completely quiet, but um, that can sometimes be great too. So it's like everything is available for you to, to work with in a certain sense. It's like in a certain moment, something will attract you to use um, to just deepen your experience. And um, so to be um, to know some of the possibilities, this is definitely one of them. Like I have great experiences with doing holding my hands together, um, just as an as a say a form of meditation. I, this works the best for me in the morning if I do it like this. And um, so you have your own practice and develop your own ways in a certain sense. But like I. I don't always do it like this, so I don't want to become ritualistic in any kind. Just having some variety, and um, yeah, this is this is one of them. All right, so we continue with the second part of this. It's like okay, we did the meditation. We we really tuned in with ourselves here, so we definitely created some space in our minds. It might already be cluttered again with ideas that you hold about something. So it's a specific way of holding your hands. And, and it's not about that, but it's great to use it. Um, just like words, it is not about the words, but we use them. Just as long as we need them, we use them. So experiencing light goes directly beyond words and and techniques and all that. So it's the light of communication, really. And that's why it's so crucial, because it's in fact what is, yeah, what is in, in a certain sense in a goal of this, what we do, is to come into the, uh, the awareness of direct communication and seeing that minds communicate and that we're communicating as one, that that is natural. And so everything that we learned after that uh, is, is in fact in the way and, and will be undone in order for you to, to come into full awareness that there's only one thing going on. It's this beautiful communication where, where we experience our connectedness to every aspect of creation. So I want to sink a little deeper into a certain expression that I shared with you in the so in the preparation PDF as the preparation for this class. See, there's there's something that in here um, that that is exactly what I'm talking about. So this is from A Course in Miracles. There's a light that this world cannot give, yet you can give it as it was given you. And as you give it, it shines forth to call you from the world and follow it. It calls you from the world and follow it. For this light will attract you as nothing in this world can do. And you will lay aside the world and find another. So in fact, I want to um, say, look at this expression. Because this holds so much that it's like this is the essence of, of what we're sharing today. So there's a light in you that the world cannot give. You can give it as it was given you. You can give it. And as you give it, it shines forth to call you from the world and follow it. For this light will attract you as nothing in this world can do. And you will lay aside the world and find another. So this is, this is um, something to stand still with because you, you recognize that something is pulling you. You know, you, you have something that is pulling you in this process that we're in, in this transformation um, of um, mind. I've got to turn something off here. So, um, so there's something attracting you so deeply that you that you are here that you decide yes i want to do this yes i sign up for this i i feel yeah called to do so i really want to discover something more because there is something that is calling me that is so attractive to me that i want more of it i want to become really like um yeah that i can do that really well in fact i want to uh, 
get into the yeah exploration and and expansion of this i want more of that light that i experience that i glimpse sometimes see that that pull that magnetic force that brings you here and inspires you to to do your exercises and your readings and study and meditation uh, that light um, you want more of it this is what i'm saying and uh, so um, some questions that may arise is like how can you yeah get more of it how 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 does this actually work this light how and and actually you can say like the awareness of it is um, makes it for you easier to recognize that it is a possibility um, what I'm actually expressing here is this is like you know that the experience of light of this of this different frequency that we're that we're talking about um, you know that that is different than your daily life existence frequency or your human yeah when you really behave like a human and feel <laughs> feel like a human that's a different energy and you know that so it's like it, it it is not uh it hasn't doesn't have that what light has it's pretty fake what i'm sharing here right now it's not so clear at all but like in my mind it's very clear because i love the light so to speak but to express it i don't know so radiating it that's easier because in fact you give it you recognize it in yourself and you give it you recognize it in your brother and you 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 share that like you literally sh shine your light into your brother so this happens every time that you're open to receive say that frequency and um it is an invitation yes indeed so it invites you to do that and it it is attractive but also it's like you can do this you you don't need to have um, uh, yeah, permission of anyone to shine your light you know we know this song right like um, this little heart of mine of this little light of mine I'll let it shine let it shine let it shine well it can be as simple as that sometimes you just have to start singing a song or doing a dance I saw the other day too like the, that that works so beautiful and so you you start to move around and suddenly it's like a fire um, that is that is like expanding like there's no tomorrow and there isn't so so this light is great it's great to to um, say find ways to to give it away literally so when you give it away Here's the, what it says too. When you give it away, in the piece of text that I just shared with you, when you give it away, it pulls you away from the world. That goes automatically. So, in other words, if you are occupied, preoccupied, completely preoccupied with the world, and you recognize like, oh my God, I'm just sinking right into matter, so to speak. I'm, I'm feeling that I'm sinking down into something here find ways to express this light find ways to give that light away whether that's in this meditation whether that's by putting your hands on your physicality like give yourself light ask for light ask for the experience of light um, start dancing forget about yeah allow your mind to relax a little bit and so breathing is good for that too that's what we practice during the meditation so there's all kinds of things that you literally can do to to uh, lift yourself uh, lift your attention and in fact uh, allow yourself to be uh, removed from the focus on the world but come into a place where you can yeah extend your light and and give it away and shine it away 
so that yeah that's great that's why my light, uh, light is so crucial I give it away and it becomes more it's not that you lose something so that's that's even more wonderful so it's like a win-win situation no matter where you are you can you can literally do that and, and this can be by thoughts by thinking like you literally bless the room that you enter into you you start to tell a joke instead of a serious story about something that happened the other day like yeah just crack it up you know crack yourself and others up and um, this is all helping you to open your mind for for light to come in and to shine through your awareness and see that that changes your body and and everything around you oh, yeah. so it is so practically applicable so no matter where you are you can actually do this and and yeah so that that's what i wanted to share regarding this the practicality of uh, the awareness of light and by giving it away seeing it increase instead of getting less so light and thinking like is is really something like you share this beautiful idea uh, in that it becomes stronger in you wonderful so that's another thing but there are different episodes that we go through here so this was one of the practicality just like we did the meditation this is also very practical now we sink deeper and deeper and deeper into um, see there's a specific part when you start to um, what we did in the first steps like you determined that you want to see things differently and you persevere in it not holding on to it but persevering in the idea that yes I confirm my commitment to this yes I practice this Yes, I'm doing the exercises. Yes, I do this and that. Whatever I can do, like no matter what I need to do, I want that. Above all else, I want that. I want to experience peace and love and light. 